and in a well-meaning but disastrous move, as a new kid I've got to wear a massive green badge. At least I could discuss it with my head of sixth, Mr Gilbert. He seemed like an intelligent man. Mr Gilbert, you seem an intelligent man. Oh, I seem intelligent. How lovely of you to say. No, I, I just meant... I mean, I've long since been insecure about my capacity for learning, so it's nice to have it ratified by you, a child. What I meant was, do you really think these badges that single us out as new kids are a good idea? Yes. If you have any more views on it, I suggest you join the School Debating Society. Obviously, you'll have to start one first. Oh, my mistake. He's a wanker. Guard had to meet with a head and his pet ape, Gilbert. What's his problem? What? That Gilbert. What a tosser. I mean, ooh, I'm Mr Gilbert. I'm such a big, huge, massive freak. And I just love to suck the headmaster's balls. And then... Is he behind me? Did you hear any of that? Oh, yes. Can we start again? All these people you've served, whatever bloody ID they used, are under age! Right, we're closed. Everyone out! Oh. Oh. You lot are all bad! Oh. Oh. Out! Oh. Nice to see you again, Mackenzie. And congratulations on doing my job for me. I'll make sure you get another badge for this. Sir. Now, get out. I want to have a pint. Oh, hello there. This is Mrs Cooper, Simon's mother, year 12. Simon and his friend Winnie McKenzie have come down with food poisoning. Must have been from the chicken. You put on your mum's voice. Oh, I'm sorry, Mrs Cooper. Now, you say your son is ill. Yes. Oh, well, Mr Gilbert, the head of six is just here. Um, I'll pass him over. Hold on one second. Oh, no, there's really no need. Look, if we hurry, we can still make it in time for English. Hello? Hello, this is Mrs Cooper, Simon is friend. Winnie, we're in work Thank you, goodbye. Mrs Cooper? What exactly is wrong with Simon? Food poisoning. OK, Simon. That's enough. I know you're bullshitting me. I think you better get into school. Cheers, all the best. God bless. I'd get in before you make things... Well, that was fucking dreadful. I think he bought it, though. Ah, boys! Going to be to join us today. Oh, shit. Shit, indeed. Now, boys, you are in the sixth form. So, actually, you're under no legal obligation to attend school. Sutherland, Cartwright, if you want to piss away your chance of gaining some qualifications and improving your lives, then be my guest. I still get paid at the end of the week. Really? Oh, great. Brilliant. Thanks, sir. However, Cooper, Mackenzie, phoning the school and pretending to be your parents. Oh, that, my little friends, is fraud. I think we'd better go and see the head. Oh, shit, it's Gilbert. Good. Now Donovan's in trouble. Oh, well, don't grass. Cooper, Sutherland, Cartwright, and who have we under here? Mackenzie, sir. Oh, let me guess. No one saw how this happened. I suppose you tripped. No, sir. What happened Sorry, is... Sorry, Mackenzie. You're not about to grass, are you? Sir? There's one thing no one likes. It's a grass. So I will ask you how this happened, and you will reply, I tripped. But, sir, if no one reported crimes, the justice system would collapse and... I'll ask you again. How did this happen? I tripped. Clumsy. So tomorrow is your Christmas party, or prom, if you will insist on speaking like our transatlantic cousins. Now, obviously, we want you to have fun, but in order to make it enjoyable for everyone, we have a few rules. One, everyone will get two alcoholic drink tokens and no more. Frankly, the last thing I want is to be cleaning up your dreadful sick. Or even worse, you putting your arms around me and telling me that I'm all right for a teacher and that you love me. Two, this is a school dance and not the last days of Rome. <laughs> what I mean by this is no heavy petting and I will be the judge of what constitutes heavy. Pervert! I heard that. But if I see anything that I consider too much, you will be sent home. Is that clear? Sir. Is that clear? Yes, sir. Good. Have a nice evening. I'll leave you in the hands of the chairman of the organising committee. And God help you, William Mackenzie. Thanks, Phil. Now... Sorry. Thanks for that, Phil. Phil? Oh, 
It's just because the dance is outside of school time, so I assumed... Well, you assumed wrong, Will. Very wrong. Sorry. Right, then. Um... Say my name properly. Mr Gilbert. Say thank you. Thank you. Say thank you, Mr Gilbert. Thank you, Mr Gilbert. Better. Don't worry, sir. Well done, children. A fairly innocuous jamboree of adolescent nonsense. Fear not, the relationships that some of you have entered into tonight, well, they may seem like everything now, but they'll be over in a matter of weeks. Now, if we can just make it home without tagging people's property... Yeah. I may go to bed relatively hate-free. Oi! You two! Do you want me to fetch up my dinner? Go home!